Hey everyone, this is Darren Buss again back with the EVP sessions in this very first EVP, which we are at the Camry House back in 2020. And the Connor sisters are performing a seance in the kitchen part. So I do not have notes for this uh, episode. So if you, whatever you find, write down in the comments. I'll be curious as to what you find. So with that, Happy EVP hunting, and yeah, let's see how this goes for the first time. All right. Okay. That's so, so what are we doing? Okay, so she's going to link us up in just a second. What I was going to say to you, though, because you know these spirits directly. I mean, you know more of the history. Yeah. Once we start getting in it, if there's one that you want to connect with, um, what do you say, you know, if you call upon them? Call yeah. Them. Yeah. That's something, okay, so you have your traditional seances. We kind of put that out the window with our people. Um, traditionally, a uh, one medium is supposed to speak yeah. and no one else. But that <coughs> what we do, we let everybody speak. Um, once I go in and link us up, I won't talk anymore. Because, like I told you, I've warned everybody that if I do something funky, it's because I'm but me seeing them know, you know, I've told you guys that I tend to just push myself out and wander around the house. So I'll be doing that. But if you guys want to ask questions, you know, anything that you feel here, just feel free to say it. Okay. Um, anything touching you? Actually, you'll notice she does tend to think it more with this kind of. Yeah. Um, if this house wants to respond to say, okay. some houses we go in and it's like, I've ones that they don't like they're really super christian and they're like this is not our type of thing um sometimes they have a hard time dealing with it but if they do want to respond and they want to talk um you'll notice that the the magnetic i guess you can feel it because you start tingling then you'll feel like little things touching you especially in the table kids love to touch on the table okay um things like that so keep that in mind actually just she feels bugs running off <coughs> Everybody has a different flavor. If it's okay, okay. you'll see that every one of them that comes in here. Traditionally, the um, the seances they'll touch pinkies. We don't. We, we don't dance. Have. So I that's just it. one of the etiquette things we like to tell people. Oh, so you get anybody else that comes in. So yeah, yeah, that's pretty All much right. it. So we do under, over, under, over, and we'll just link it that way. You may feel the heartbeat in the hands. That's mm -hmm. quite all right. Okay. And if you need the itch, just tell the person beside you, and then just be like, "Yeah, yeah I got a scratch." Yeah. 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 Yeah.
That was a flash that I got shown. I don't know what's going on, but the fire is very predominant right now with who, whatever spirit is here. Um, wow. You're the spirit um, having to do with the fire. If you want to um, show that you're here with us by our candles, you're more than welcome to do that too. Um, you can make it go up, you can make it go down, any way you want to. Um, choosing to um, the fire might be something that you know being that it was explosion that he resonates with maybe that's why he wanted to come forward um, that's kind of cool that you know that he's still around because he definitely is um, he gives that off very strongly um, did anybody in the house have a breathing problem because when I come around here it's kind of harder for me to breathe mm -hmm. in this room it was like, it's like I can't get my breath I'm trying to take deep breaths with me yeah yeah, the air here is very heavy. Yeah. Like that room that we were in upstairs. So, Aiklin's playing, um, excuse me, died from an illness, which we're assuming is probably like a long thing, or like a flu type, you know. Because I was like, well, maybe it's because you can't wait. But then I was able to go down that trail, and I, like, head straight up on that trail, and I was going to say, if you didn't 
Bring the heavy on that trail. You're yeah. <laughs> and then I was out in town and I was fine. So it was around the front of the house and then throughout the house it was randomly in happen. And I was like, well, maybe it's just the way the house smells in certain areas because certain houses have smells. But it would come and go. Now I'm in here and occasionally I'll get a bad smell. So it was like a breathing problem. Like she couldn't catch her breath. Yeah, I have it's like a pneumonia or something like that. Yeah. Could it possibly have been uh, tuberculosis consumption? Possibly. As they call it? Possibly. No one was picking up on that upstairs. It just said an illness. Okay. And like I said, we've pulled, pulled that up before the heart beating. So. Um, the name Lewis? That's coming in pretty strong right now. Um, also, uh, there's one that's coming through super emotional. So I don't know if this is Lewis or whoever, um, but when they try to get their point across or try to get close to me, they're almost crying. Um, so sometimes they do that though um, because they are just excited to interact, you know? Mm -hmm. um, so I'm not for sure. Um, One of them is talking about two. He keeps mentioning two, two. Uh, I don't know what that means. Uh, so I'm going to have to sit on that for a minute. Uh, Lewis is the name of the little boy. Oh, fuck. Okay, I'm sorry. I don't mean cut. I don't know if I can cut there. I'm <laughs> <laughs> uh, we're cutting. Um, we're good. Okay, good. I don't... That's the weird part that they... Um, that. Okay, thank you for that because... I don't see him. Um, I didn't see him like Ashley did. 